just crazy feeling. You're staring up at the sky and you can't move anything. And you're laying there and you go, holy crap, I'm paralyzed. It was just a normal Saturday. Grabbed my dirt bike on my lunch break and headed to the motocross track. Was jumping a new jump and gave a little bit too much gas, going too fast. Something happened when I landed and I flipped forward. Hit my head and my chin touched my chest and broke my C4 vertebrae. Uh, and that bruised my spinal cord and just landed on my back and was immediately paralyzed. They told me right away, you know, you've got a bad neck injury, your, your spinal cord has been bruised, or the bones poking the spinal cord. And we went into surgery, I mean, in less than a couple hours. And they take all of the bones out of that vertebrae and put a cage in there. And they put all the bones back inside the cage. And then they fuse the third, fourth, and fifth vertebrae together. Our uh, neighbor in Glenwood, Polly Mailhorn, actually said, well, hey, if you're coming up here, there's a program I work with called Bridging Bionics. So Mason came to Bridging Bionics in October of 2019. That was seven months after his uh, spinal cord injury at C5. And the first day he was here, he was uh, super motivated, and he showed me he could move his, his right leg a little bit. I think the maybe second or third session, they had me up inside that that XO, and we were walking, and it felt so natural. And then we're working out one day, and Maria goes, "Hey, do you want to try standing up in the parallel bars?" And I kind of was like, "Are you are you talking to me? Like, you know?" And, First time Maria's like, all right, we're gonna try to, to walk. And she you know, would help me move my feet out in front of me. Because Mason had movement, he could wiggle his toes and a couple of fingers. That means that there are signals past his break and his neck, so that there is connections between the brain down to the muscles. I think a year and a week later after I got hurt, I was able to lift that left leg and take that first step. So today, you know, I finally got to where I can go to therapy on my own. I'm strong enough to get in my van and transfer myself over and drive myself to therapy, which has been a huge thing of freedom and independence. I'm able to go in and go walking around three times a week. You know, we'll just be in that robot and I'm taking a, a, a stroll outside by the pool. The people that donate to Bridge and Bionics and help them do what they do to help me, without those donations and those supporters, the program wouldn't exist and I wouldn't have any of the progress that I've made today. There truly are creating miracles, making miracles happen. But there's no end for his recovery. As he's a part of Bridge and Bionics, we'll, uh, we'll work with him until he's uh, reached his full capacity. We provide affordable access to consistent physical therapy and personal training for a nominal fee of $500 per year. More than 50% of our clients receive a full scholarship. We do not bill insurance. We are a charitable organization. Through giving the gift of mobility to our clients, we are able to provide access to advanced technologies, including whole body vibration systems and a range of bionic exoskeleton suits.